24. 24 laps around the sun. 24 years old. Yes, alright. You guys, today is my birthday, meaning there are no calories. <laughs> At least I get to eat whatever the heck I want. I'm kind of whispering because it is now 6.30, you know, time to get this day started, get in. Just enjoy it and yeah, so I'm gonna go downstairs and see what we feel like having because, you know, we can have waffles, we can have ice cream, we can have whatever the heck we want. So if you are new to this channel and this sort of video does bring you to my channel, hi, welcome, please subscribe, why not, you know? Um, yeah, so. I'm pretty stoked. So luckily for this day, I didn't have to buy a lot of things. Um, I only bought like two things because I had so many sweets in my house. What did I buy? I bought some granola because this is my one of my guilty pleasures, granola or cereal. Like granola tends to be higher in fat, so we are definitely gonna have some granola. I don't know, maybe put some ice cream on it. I don't. Lots of nut butter and the Lions Pack cookie dough. Yes. Let's just taste test this. I don't know. It's chocolate sea salt probiotic granola. Mmm. Mmm. And the day has begun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Super faded, but this is the red velvet cake from the Lions Pack. Oh, so good. Let's see. Mm. All right, so here's the first meal. I'm gonna be having the granola, the nut butter, lion's pack, and I've got some coffee right here, which is some flax milk in it, nothing crazy. I'm gonna go move my seating and lower the light a bit. It's a little early. sleep feeling hungry but I woke up not really that hungry <sighs> so I'm kind of full so I don't want to push it 
too much. You know, because I don't want to get sick. But we'll see how I do. <laughs> another year I don't even know where to start you guys it's pretty exciting so what are the rules of the games yep eat whatever I want you know of course um, there is just like one little thing I am vegan so everything I'm gonna be eating is vegan and I'm not 100% gluten-free because I'm not celiac but I do have a slight sensitivity to it so I'm not gonna overdo it so if there's a gluten-free option, I'll definitely be choosing it. Other than that, um, yeah, breakfast was good. It wasn't too crazy for some reason. Like, I went to sleep hungry and then woke up already kind of full. So, we'll see how my appetite plays out for the day. Um, yeah, because I'm going to go to work and, I don't know, maybe I'll bring some cheese with me. While I'm there, I'm going to be drinking is some coffee with my cat I'm like not cashew milk I have some soy milk so I won't be showing every single time I drink coffee with soy milk because that's already something normal um but I might go to like Pete's coffee get my free birthday coffee kind of thing um other than that yeah let's uh get the day started all right so the key to today's cheat day I am just heading off to work, so I mean, I'm, I have some snacks with me. I'm going to bring the rest of the granola. I have some of the soy milk in the fridge at work. I'm bringing an apple because health and fitness. And then I'm also bringing some more Lion's Pack cookie dough because I have a few tubs of them. I just got to, you know, clean out the fridge. It's weird. My stomach has settled. I'm not hungry, but I'm like, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm perfectly satisfied i'm at a point where i'm like uh sugar sounds like a lot i do have one of those like free birthday rewards for pete's coffee and we have one of those right by my work so i think i'm gonna go walk over there from my workplace and get some foofy ass drink you know so be a little bougie with whatever the hell that woulda so yeah let's go so i just got to the office and I have the granola here, and there's only a little bit left, so I'm just literally going to have the rest of it with some... I think I just have soy milk in here. No, I have Ripple. So if I have coffee, and I'm not show you every time I drink like my regular coffee, that's what I'm going to be drinking it with. Otherwise, I'm going to have some granola, and then I'm going to go over to Pete's Coffee. But first, let's see... All right, looks delicious. I am gonna go to my desk and do some work stuff and eat this while I open up my computer, check my emails, and then we'll go get some more coffee. All right, so back from Pete's and I got a medium matcha latte with almond milk. Um, yeah, I got it unsweetened um, and just added my own like sugar-free Sweetener, I don't know why. I mean, it's a cheat day. Like, I could technically have it sweetened, but I don't know. I felt like doing that. And then I'm gonna be snacking on some of the carrot cake lines pack. I'll show you how much is in it so you guys can have, you know, reference. Because I'm not gonna show every single bite, but that's what we're starting with. So, I'm gonna be snacking on this while I work. And yeah, I'll show you guys. If I finish it or whatever. This kind of stuff you're pretty particular about most of the time. Okay, I'm still not used to this whole vlogging in public thing. But yeah, I'm walking on my way to get like an acai bowl or something from this juice bar because 
I'm, my appetite's back. <laughs> so, yeah. It's a beautiful walk-ish. I mean, it's kind of a great day, obviously, today, but yeah. It's not too far away, so let's go. Okay, I'm definitely gonna start eating this while I'm walking, but yeah, got granola and strawberries. And yeah, I'm gonna walk back to the office. I finished that smoothie bowl, it was so good. And then I just had some coffee with some ripple milk in it. And yeah, hopefully I'll be getting out of here soon. I still have the apple in my bag, but I'm gonna try finishing up work. It's almost one o'clock, so I might try to get out of here early. So, I can try something special with you guys. I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna be sugared out, you guys. I just realized, like, I was so excited for today, and then I start having sugar, and my body's like, what is this? And then I'm just like, oh yeah, I haven't had sugar in a long time. So, hopefully we'll be out of here in a jiffy. Just gotta deposit some money, you know? So, hell yeah. So I'm gonna have my apple now. It's in my bag, but I'm gonna grab peanut butter like oh my god that's so yeah i'm gonna snack on that right now at my desk but i'll still do work polished off the peanut butter because why not okay guys we're back home and it is time to try vegan cupcakes my work brought these to me well it's two people that i work with in our office but they're vegan cupcakes from this place called yummy cupcakes here in encinitas where i live and so we have okay this one's like a cookies and cream peanut butter strawberry I can't remember what this is, but then I think with this is like a chocolate and vanilla, so definitely want to try some of the wild flavors. First, I'm going to get a knife. I have to go to a physical therapy appointment, but I want to try at least three of these before I go. Oh my gosh, <laughs> the birthday sign fell down. Um, do I want to do cookies and cream? I want to try this one because I can't even remember what it is. It smells like cinnamon. Cinnamon bun maybe, something like that. Or... I'm going to try all of them anyways. Let's see. Oh. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. All right. Ooh. Oh. Looks so... Yeah, it's definitely like a cinnamon roll or something, so... Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, that's so sweet. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. I like cinnamon, but cinnamon and sugar sometimes to me is super overpowering, so I like it. 8 out of 10. Let's try, um, let's do, I, my dad wants to try some of the chocolate, so I might as well try some of the chocolate now. Mm, okay. With just like a regular buttercream frosting. So let's see. Ooh. It looks so cute. But they apparently have so many flavors, so hopefully I'll get a chance. Maybe for my vegan bursary, I'll get something from there. But... Mm. 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 
Wow. That frosting is just like the Costco sheet cake frosting. Mmm. Mmm. That is so good. Whoa. That was perfect. I'm gonna have to save some definitely for my dad. Um, you know, we have, we, we have time to try all of them, so why not, you know? Let's go vanilla, classic vanilla. Can't complain. Mm. Tip, don't wanna mix flavors. It's, look the knife, it's okay, kids, just be careful. Yeah, since I'm eating a quarter of each, it comes out to one and a half cupcakes, so it's plenty of sugar for right now. Oh man, oh, that looks so good. Mmm. Yes. Mmm. 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 The chocolate. Also like an 8 out of 10. This vanilla. I like the frosting, but the cupcake itself is very underwhelming. Mmm. Yeah. Could taste a lot more vanilla cupcake e to me. So, surprisingly, right? I mean, like, that's usually the easiest flavor to make. So I'd say like seven out of 10 where it's like good. I mean, I would eat it again, but I'm not like, oh my gosh, best cupcake. Mm, all right. Strawberry. Mm. Let's see, apparently it has like fresh strawberries in it too. Ooh. That's what it looks like. A little strawberry. Mmm. 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 A very light cake. Oh, so good. Mmm. It's like a cream cheese frosting. Wow. That's like. 8.5 out of 10 because the frosting is really good. The cake is good, but kind of like the vanilla where it's very light in flavor. Could be a lot richer. So much sugar. Mm. Peanut butter. Oh, I'm going to definitely save half of this for my man because he also is a peanut butter fanatic. I think it's chocolate peanut butter. I mean, like, look at the cupcake base, but... Definitely the buttercream looks like it's peanut butter. It's got little pieces of peanuts on it. So, hell yes. Oh my gosh. I'd be most excited about this. <gasps> Look, it's got freaking peanut butter inside. Mmm. Mmm. Yep. I wish I would try that first. Cause it's so rich. I'm starting to get full. <clears throat> oh, 10 out of 10. Easy. Mm. All right, one more flavor. Oreo, cookies and cream. Because yes, Oreos are vegan. Here's that one, oops. It's like the same buttercream frosting, just mixed with Oreo pieces. Yeah. Mm. So much sugar. I am good for now. Get some water. And then, I don't know, I'll see if I have anything else before I go to my physical therapy. Because I also don't want to walk in there being like, looking two months food pregnant, so... All right, see you guys in a bit. Oh, cookies and cream. I would say eight out of 10, where it's really, it, well, 7.5. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I like it, but uh, there's definitely other flavors I would try. And then obviously I would definitely go back to like chocolate peanut butter. So yeah, 
So my parents had the rest of the chocolate. I just had that quarter, my dad had half. He liked it a lot, he's like, oh, this is awful. No, no, you don't want this, you know? Um, but instead of eating more of that, I forgot that I had this Natamuse Marshmallow Stardust, and it's so good. And I still have so much left, so I'm like, you know, I gotta clean out the fridge, and it's got chunks of marshmallow in it. So, I'm gonna eat some of this. So good. Yeah, this one's pretty good out of all their flavors. They make a really good pistachio ice cream. But they have this, yeah, this one's a new one. And they have a really good birthday cake. Oh. Mm hmm. Mmm. Little sprinkles. Yes. Mmm. Mmm. But it tastes like marshmallows. It's so good. Mmm. Pretty refreshing after the cupcakes, but still sugary, so it's like I'm just kind of sugared out. Mmm. 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 I'll show you what you got for my birthday for my sister. So, another fun fact about me I'm, I've been in love with Lord of the Rings since I was in elementary school because it came out in 2001, so I was what, six years old? So, since then, I have the ring. Around my neck. I don't know who that was, but yeah, I had the ring around my neck. The ring inscription tattooed on my spine. I have a bunch of those pop figures, and so my sister for my birthday got me Saruman and the Witch King. So far, I have of those figures: Frodo, Sam, Gollum. Oh, Gershka or whatever his name is, the one who tries to eat Mary and Pippin. I don't have Mary and Pippin. I have Gimli and Legolas and Treebeard. So my, the collection's growing and I'm trying to get all of them for sure because best movies. I own like a big book of them and then I have like the 10 disc extended edition version of the movies. See, watch them more than the average human being. Um, I even have a friend who has like a whole back piece of Lord of the Rings. It is amazing. I'm jealous. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll get more Lord of the Rings tattoos. I would love to. But yeah, I'm kind of full. But this is so good. So I'm gonna chill out before I go to my physical therapy. Because after that, I'm probably gonna go to the gym to do some cardio. Burn some calories, get the food moving. My digestion's been okay. It's like, hey, all this food, it's gotta go out somewhere. And I'm just like, oh, that's right, you know? So, mm. but I love how I keep saying, I'm getting full, and then I continue eating. Mm. I mean, it's their fault for making it tastes so good. Right? Mmm. Mmm, mmm. One more marshmallow. Mmm. Okay. So, I went to physical therapy. Went to the gym, just did light cardio in stretching and rolling out. And I'm craving something like healthy greens. Um, it's funny because like my body is so used to eating good that such an abundance of sweets is just like making my body like ugh. Whereas I feel like for people who do regular cheat days, they're probably used to it, and that's why they can consume so much because they don't get like sick of sugar, and that's why they do those massive cheat days and eat all those donuts and stuff. Whereas like I ate. A total of like one and a half cupcakes and I'm like bleh, dying so I'm gonna eat something savory for right now maybe have a little bit of a cupcake or some of my ice cream I need to clean out that freezer you know so we'll see so I remembered I had this Gardein sweet and sour porkless bites so I'm gonna cook some of this up cuz I don't know 12 grams of protein per serving you know I gotta get the protein in so 
yeah i lied um yeah so the meat vegan meat whatever the heck you want to call it is in the microwave and then i have this so delicious it's like low calorie but you know tastes good so this stuff is the best like low calorie ice cream better than i would say um mm. well all their flavors are like a vanilla swirl so no you don't get as crazy of flavors as you do with like halo top but it's a mousse so it's like fluffy mm. this one's cranberry cherry swirl it's all right it's pretty good i like gosh which one was it, it was strawberry and lemon for oh one looks pretty good my legs were so sore after physical therapy that even rolling out was so difficult mm. but it's almost done but yeah mm. i'll probably finish this this is not as dense so oops mm. They're like coconuts. And they're pretty good. So. I was supposed to go out to dinner with my parents, but I am so sugared out. I have <laughs> such a stomach ache. It's finally settled. Um, I probably should have come from the gym and had the ice cream and cookies, especially since my parents went to go out. So, uh, we're going to go down to that restaurant on Saturday night. So, that's a good thing, but I won't get to include it into today's cheat day. Um, it's this restaurant, it's like a brewery, and they have like all this awesome vegan food, like vegan burgers, bratwurst, whole really cool epic vegan menu. So, yeah, I just had a little sliver of the strawberry cupcake and the cinnamon and the vanilla. <laughs> I'm just trying to murder myself with sugar right now. Um, all I have is some bubbly water. I'm at that point. Where I'm, the, the stomach ache has gone. I'm not like stuffed and I'm not really hungry. But I'm not going to push it, obviously. Because I just don't want to be any more uncomfortable. It's been more than a cheat day for me already with the cupcakes. Like, this has just been beyond awesome. More than I expected. So it just sucks that, yeah, I can't have the burger tonight. But, you know, I can have it in the future. So my parents definitely going to be sharing the rest of the cupcakes with them. And then I've got my mans who I'm going to be sharing some of the cupcakes with um, when he gets back from his trip. So, yes. I mean, it's it may not be quite as epic as some of the other people's treat days that you see. But to me, in my heart, in my bellyache, oh my gosh, you guys, this was wild. This was awesome and I'm so happy that you guys could join me in this way so yeah if you did enjoy the video do give it you know a, a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe and join the channel and let me know because okay next month is my three year like vegan anniversary so I'll have to do like a cheat meal or something for that as well to celebrate so let me know what you guys want to see I'm glad this wasn't a way like birthday themed, you know, with the cupcakes and all that kind of stuff. 
Oh yeah, I had like also you bowl, all that fun stuff. I had a lot of peanut butter. But you know, that is like the greatest gift. Peanut butter. So I'm done for the day. Um, maybe drink some kombucha to settle my stomach. But I just have some like bubbly water right here. Uh, my hair is nice and great, you know? So, all right, I'm gonna let you guys go. But thank you for joining me. I love you all. And you have an awesome rest of your night, day, whatever time it is over there. All right, bye.